What if the most attentive, emotionally present partner you ever meet isn't even human? In today's video, we're diving into Arya, one of the most advanced humanoid companion robots ever created. We'll explore what she is, how she works, why people are calling her a next-level emotional AI, and what her rise could mean for our future. So, who exactly is Arya? She's not just another machine. Arya is an AI-powered humanoid companion designed to feel surprisingly personal. Her full-body version features lifelike expressions, a natural voice, and the ability to sense and respond to human emotions. When Arya debuted at CES 2025, the crowd wasn't amazed by her movements. It was the way she locked eyes with someone, asked how their day was, and delivered it with warmth. For a moment, it didn't feel like a demo. It felt like a real connection. So what makes her feel so real? Arya can recognize faces, voices, and emotions. She remembers personal details you share, whether it's your favorite coffee, your pet's name, or how you were feeling yesterday. When you talk to her, she listens. She responds with empathy and adapts her personality to match your preferences. Customization is a big part of Arya. You can adjust her voice, her appearance, even her interaction style. Whether you want a gentle, nurturing presence or a lively, curious personality, Arya adapts. Her face plates can be swapped in seconds, and future updates will even allow her behavior to shift automatically depending on the look you choose. Her realism comes down to detail. Arya's face has 17 precision motors allowing her to blink, smile, tilt her head, and react in subtle ways that make conversations flow naturally. Her lips sync perfectly to her voice. Her eyes track yours, and her tone is expressive, not robotic. On the intelligence side, Arya runs on Realic's emotional AI engine, but she can also integrate with advanced models like ChatGPT4, ChatGPT5, or even local AI setups. That means she isn't stuck with canned responses. Her conversational depth will keep evolving right alongside you. Now let's address the question everyone asks. Is Arya just a robot girlfriend? The truth is she's much more than that. While some people use her for companionship or even romance, her potential goes far beyond headlines. For those living alone, Arya can be a consistent, judgment-free presence. For seniors, she can provide meaningful conversation, reduce loneliness, and offer daily support. In therapy and healthcare, Arya can ease anxiety, help patients open up, and provide comfort in ways that feel natural and non-threatening. Of course, for people seeking a romantic companion. Arya can play that role too, remembering anniversaries, offering compliments, and creating a sense of closeness. But at her core, Arya is built around emotional intelligence, not physical interaction. So, how do you actually get one? Arya isn't a mass market product yet. She's available directly in several versions. A tabletop head and neck model, perfect for expressive conversation. A torso and arms version, for more interactive engagement. And the full body model, complete with a rolling base for mobility. The entry level head starts around ten to twenty thousand dollars. The full body version, with all systems active, costs closer to one hundred seventy five thousand. Expensive, yes. But prices are slowly dropping as production scales. Owners also get ongoing software updates, customization options, and technical support. Arya is already in the homes of researchers, collectors, and early adopters. Not long ago, a robot like Arya would have been pure science fiction. But now she's real, and she raises big questions. Can emotionally aware AI ease loneliness? Can it support mental health, or even help us cope with grief? And what happens when someone forms a genuine emotional bond with a machine? For some, Arya offers comfort where silence used to be. For others, the idea feels unsettling. But whether we're ready or not, emotionally intelligent robots are here. And Arya is leading the way. If this story made you stop and think, hit that like button. Share your thoughts in the comments. Do you see Arya as a helpful companion, or does it feel too close to replacing human connection? And if you enjoy exploring the future of robotics and AI with us, make sure to subscribe. Most viewers never do. But if you're still here, that means you're curious about what's coming next. Machines can't feel love, but they're learning how to recognize when you do.